as you all might be knowing, the Arunachal Film Festival has been going on for I think more than a decade now. It started in somewhere around 2013. And initially the department was doing it. Then uh, in between, for a couple of years, it was outsourced. Then again later, uh, the department decided that it would do it by, uh, by itself this year. And uh, this year, it will start, uh, it be on 8th and 9th of February at uh, the DK Convention Hall. Basically, this festival is to showcase the local uh, talents that we have in Arunachal. As you know, like they don't get much space outside the state. So through this, we are trying to create a platform for them through which they can, you know, like they get to, be, we'll be having uh, screenings of their movies, documentaries, short films, and we'll also be having seminars and workshops, panel discussions, in which they'll be able to interact with renowned uh, directors and actors from outside. Hopefully this year, even though like we've got a limited budget, we are hoping that uh, this will help our local talent in showing their cap capability to the outside world. As of now, no specific uh, policy is there. It is through these festivals that we are trying to showcase their talents. And uh, one positive thing I can tell you is that our film and television institute at Jyote, hopefully by uh, May or June this year, it should become functional and uh, the regular classes will start there. Right now we are holding it in a temporary accommodation in the SC, what do you call it, Grand Hotel, where limited uh, classes are being taken in batches. So from the next year, once we have our own full budget film and television institute, we hope that our youth who are interested in cinematography and the, its varied aspects, they will get an opportunity to uh, do their films there also. Which will, like, this will have its own sound studios and or lighting and sets and all that, film sets. Uh, sir, are we expecting any... Uh renowned filmmakers in the festival? Yes, uh, quite a lot of them in fact. There is uh, Meenakshi Shadda, you must be knowing about Meenakshi Shadda, she is uh, not only national, international level, she is a critic and curator. Then we have Prithvi Buddha Bharapu. Then we have panel discussions with Dominic Sangma, Tai Gumte, then a few members of the FFA and the FTGA also. And like we, my thrust here is more on the uh, workshops and the seminars and the panel discussions. Uh, I want it to be two-way traffic so that there's proper interaction between the, our youth and these uh, people from outside, these renowned people who are recognized in their own rights as uh, directors, actors, and even uh, like uh, color grading, the different aspects of filmmaking. The director of IPR through this festival would like to invite all those people who are interested in not just watching movies, but also interested in knowing how it is being made what are the nuances behind the screen? What what uh, different uh, what do you call that? Things that matter, like the sounds. We have a sound engineer who will be holding a workshop. He's from SRFTI, Satyajit Rai Film and Television Institute, Kolkata, and we have other people also like who will. Take the classes. Uh, I, like I don't, I don't like to 
use the word classes because it sounds like a student teacher is it like more like the resource person and our our youth who are interested in filmmaking 